In this tutorial, we're going to look at how to create quantity-based discounts in WooCommerce using the WooCommerce Dynamic Pricing and Discount Rules plugin. First, let's look at simple bulk or volume discounts. You can set a rule that discounts the price of a product based on the number of items the user is ordering. To add a new discount rule that can apply to multiple products, go to WooCommerce, Fees and Discounts, and click Add New. Add a title. This will only appear in the back end. Set the rule type to Bulk Pricing. Then set different levels for your discounts. For example, for 50 items or over, there's a 10% discount. For 100 items or over, there's a 20% discount. You can set percentage or fixed price discounts that can either apply per item or to the overall price. You can add a label for the front end too. This will appear in the same place as the sales flash, so it'll be styled in the same way as your theme. You can apply rules to multiple products, to product categories, or to all products in your store. Save the rule and you can see how it looks on the front end. You can choose whether to display the discount as a single amount in the cart subtotals or you can display the discounted price for each line item. The next example is tiered discounts. With this method, you set specific prices for each quantity tier. It's very similar to the bulk pricing rule we just looked at. Set the rule to bulk pricing and create your tiers. In this example, we set a fixed discount for each tier. So if your original product costs $10, you can reduce the price per unit by $1 to $9 when the user buys between 10 and 50 items. Then reduce the price to $8 per unit for between 50 and 100 items, and so on. Third is buy one, get one free, or any variation, like buy two, get one half price. To set up this rule, choose buy x, get x as the rule type. Enter how many items the user needs to buy in order to qualify for the discount. Then set how many items the user receives as free or at a discount. Now you can set the discount amount. If the user is getting the items for free, set percentage discount to 100. Otherwise set any kind of fixed or percentage discount that you like. If you want to offer a different product when the user buys a certain quantity, you can use the buy X, get Y rule. So if your quantity discount deal is something like buy two polos and get a t-shirt free, you can do that with buy X, get Y. Just enter which products the user needs to buy to qualify for the deal and which products the user will get when they qualify. Next, let's look at role-based quantity discounts. To set a role-based discount, choose your rule, for example, bulk pricing, then choose which roles will qualify for the discount. If you want to offer different pricing to different roles, just set a different rule for each role. Next, you can set discounts based on their value. So that's not strictly speaking a discount based on quantity of items. Instead, it's a discount based on the cost of the items. To do this, just choose Discount on Spend as the rule type. Then you can choose other options just the same as for the bulk pricing rules. But when you set your tiers, 
you're setting them on value, not quantity. For example, you can give your users 5% off certain items when they spend more than $100. A slight variation on this is to set discounts on the total cart amount. Choose Order Total as the rule, then set Tiers. In this case, the tiers are for the total value of the cart, not for specific items. Finally, if you want to set quantity or spend discounts on specific products, you can do that direct from the product edit screen. Go to the product that you want to offer a discount on and set your rules directly in the product data section. Choose from bulk pricing or discount on spend and create your tiers exactly as for the main rules. When you're using a quantity discount, it's a good idea to display the different discounts levels to your customers. You can do that with a pricing table like this. We looked at how to set a label to act as a sales flash earlier. You can also add a notice that will be displayed to the user to incentivize them to buy more in order to qualify for the deal. And you might not want to activate your deals all the time, so you can pause them whenever you like and even schedule them to run at certain times. Just set a start time and date and end time and date and set their status to scheduled. Your discounts will start and stop automatically. So that's how to set quantity discounts using the WooCommerce Dynamic Pricing and Discount Rules plugin. For more information, check out the resources section on the Plugin Republic website, where you'll find dozens of tutorials and case studies. We have a 14-day money-back guarantee and a world-class support team to help with any questions. Thanks for watching and make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons.